Hello, this is Rick with Cybermedics, and we're here today to talk about YoLink and its automatic shutoff valve and its smart water sensors. Earlier, I had published a couple of videos where I thought there was a problem with the sensor and the way the logic was working, but the problem is with dummy me, not YoLink. YoLink has made some great devices, but here, let's go on and show you what the situation is. So let's say the valve is closed here on this smart water valve. And let's say you detect a water leak. The valve opens. That's not what you would want to have happen, right? You wouldn't want a valve to open if there was a water leak. So the problem that happened was when I paired this device with the controller, I actually had the valve open and didn't realize it because the state of the valve is what determines what action is going to take place. So if you want this valve to close when it detects water with the water sensor, then what you have to do is when you pair the two devices, you have to do it with the valve closed. So to pair these devices, you just press and hold the set key on both devices. And then it blinks green. This one blinks green. It's pretty quick. And then they go off. That means the two devices are paired. But notice now the valve is closed. Okay, so now I'm going to open the valve. And what you would want to have happen when you detect a water leak, right, is you would want the valve to close. So there you go. Works perfectly. Just like it's supposed to. And the problem was the, the fact that the valve was open when I paired them. This time, when I repaired them, I made sure the valve was closed. And then it works appropriately for a sensor to, when it detects water. And they also have this neat little alarm, uh, audible alarm. So if you want to pair it, you would do the same thing. You could hit the set button on this till it turns green, set button on this till it turns green. Then the two would, would pair together, and then you would have an audible alarm uh, as well as this would alarm also. Um, these are pretty easy to set up. The thing I will tell you, I looked at the Flow, um, the Fin, all these other high-end systems, and this system is economical. It seems reliable. The, the fact that it does not need external power and it does not need an app or internet to function, you can use this thing totally independent of any internet connection, independent of power, and your house would be protected because I don't even have anything set up in the app and right now and it's controlling the valve. So if you have any questions, or need any help, YoLink has been great reaching out to me, and I will do anything I can to help answer any questions. This is Rick with Cybermedics signing out.